Good everybody out there in uh, Cryptoland. I am just showing you BitMEX now. I want to show you why I don't pay any attention to these buy buy and sell walls. Uh, I've seen it in stock trading before. I've I've done it with level two trading. Um, I've I've been around the the traps long enough. Watch the just watch the numbers. Right, one million on the buy side here, very little on the sell side. Now watch this jump around. Look at how quick it changes. Now are these all being filled? No, because you can see the orders and trades going through. Sometimes they all get filled, but it jumps around so much. Now, if you're trying to make a decision to place an order to trade, and you're doing it based on what this is telling you, look, look at how stacked it is on the sell side here. Watch how quickly it'll change. Okay, well, it may not. Sometimes they're strong, sometimes they're not. But you watch. Look at that. Bang, changes. It flicks around. There's fake orders. There's all sorts of nonsense that goes on in there. Now, it's really difficult to keep up with. This is why I don't use it. You know, if I'm going to raise an order, I, I, I don't care about this at all. I, I go in and I raise my order. I focus on what I know, not what is outside of my control. And all this funny bugger stuff with pulling orders, putting them in, jumping around, all these bots and whatnot, it doesn't interest me. I, I'm not going to profit from that. I'm not going to beat these bots. But I can still find um, ways to make money in the markets by making my own decisions so again you'll see look how many times in this what one minute have we seen both sides stacked heavily look buy side stacked heavily right now watch it swing in a minute it'll probably just swing across now if that doesn't occur then what we'll likely see is all these smaller orders getting taken out because we'll see all of this come into buy bang 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 we'll climb the ladder and the price will rise the price rising is important, uh, or, or going down, depending on which way you trade. What is not important is the, is the orders and how it happens. That's why I focus my time not on reading the book, okay, not on reading the buy and sell walls, because a lot of it's fake. A lot of it's so quick that you can't make a decision faster than a computer and an algorithm. What I do focus on is, you know, all of this, don't forget this, all of this that you see over here, all right, all of the, all that you see over here is going to be everything that goes through and is real that comes over on the recent trade side is going to be shown on the chart. So the chart comes up and guess what? The chart there, you can see it. The price action's there. That's what has actually occurred. All right, that is what has actually occurred. Now, I don't know why these numbers are the way they are. I don't, I don't, what I don't want you to do is, you know, I don't know why it seems to always be default of 50,000 um, and 50. Or actually, it usually defaults back to zero. Um, don't take any note of what these numbers are. I, I don't have any orders in because, you know, you, can, you can't see anything here. There's no trades on at the moment. There's no orders in. I'm waiting for a deeper pullback. It's beside the point of, the, of this video, really. You've got to understand um, what this is. And what it is, is a distraction. It's one of those things where there's lots of shiny lights and, and you want to jump onto that and you want to jump onto that and you want to jump onto that and you want to jump onto that, like indicators. A lot of people put too much time and effort into reading indicators. Read price action because what you see on the right-hand side here, which is recent trades, that is what you'll see printed on the chart. Guess what? Learn how to read the charts properly and all of this is just noise and nonsense. Again, there's a big buyer side, so a big seller side. Notice how little price has actually moved. If you're trying to trade these buy and sell walls, I think you're going to run into problems. Maybe you can do it. It's certainly not my kettle of fish. I much more, uh, much prefer to see what has been and help to predict what will be based on price action. And that's why I put so much emphasis on my teaching of price action action. It is my king, my queen, my everything. So guys, get to tradercob.com. You can find out a lot more free education there as well. Have a great day. I'll speak to you soon. I hope this was helpful. Bye for now.